So this is our page for today. Uh, this is the texture paste. I had taken two pages and smushed them together. So that's what this is. Some watercolor crayons, um, some white paint and um, stencil. Very soft, very pretty page. All right, day 26. I have these beautiful water-soluble crayons. I don't think I've ever used them, so let's play with them a little bit with no idea of how this is going to go. This is on our page that we put the texture paste on and smoosh the two pages together. It's been within the last couple of days. And I'm just uh, putting some water-soluble crayon on here, and then I'm just smudging it with my fingers. I have the blue, it's blue and magenta, I guess is what I would say. I'll put some yellow in the center. Bring my baby blue in, add some water to that. Let that drip down. I think we'll squirt it with some water. How about that? And I'm going to let that dry. So I really like what the, the spray bottle did to the watercolors, but I lost all my purple. So I'm just going to put some purple back in there. And some pink back in this side. back in the center. Life is an experiment. Clean finger, <laughs> if at all possible. And I'm just going to spritz it with the water and let it dry just like that. That's beautiful. Now I dabbed some of the watercolor paint off, which really gives it a nice texture there. I'm bringing in peeled paint, which is a bit of a green, and I'm just going to pick up the ridges from the texture paste with that. I'm going to bring my mm, punchella, <laughs> I think that's what it is, and a little bit of white paint. Just add a little bit there. There. This is that little circle that I cut out before. Use this on another page. Oh, I love that soft look.
just hit it with the Stabilo where I got the white paint on the edge. And we have another gorgeous background. June challenge, day number 26. <laughs> Go create, go play, go have fun.